Hello everybody and welcome back to Banished and Coropolis. So where did we leave things off? Well, oh my god, we're still building this path? Oh, I thought that would be done by now. I thought I started this like weeks ago. Well, in my time. Probably you guys' time as well. But yeah, like weeks ago. I don't know. In any case, where are we? So we have a lot of moo cows. We've got three here. And ooh, we have four here. Excellent. So we're getting decent amounts of uh, meat from here. That's a very good meat sources. We could start... And, ooh, we got a little trader, trader dude coming over. Uh, we could start building a little encampment, but I, like I've said in the past, I don't like hunter's lodges just because they're too unpredictable. Like, here we know we're always going to be breeding them and then killing them, so it's fine. But these guys, they, they move, they wander, so it's really hard. Anyway, I do remember that food was a very serious concern. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and unpause it, and let's see, just see what happens. I do remember we started these up, so we got one for iron, one for coal, and we have a stone quarry there as well. Now, we can't delete these when they're all used up, so it's just something to bear in mind. We do have four laborers. What are we building? Is it the, is it the paths? Oh, hi. Eh. Oh, yeah, we're waiting on sheep, aren't we? That's another thing. Uh, yeah, go ahead and dismiss you. Uh, so yeah, we would like some sheep peas for here, uh, just so we can start making clothing, but it's not a major concern for me. Why do we disable that? No idea. Oh, it's no, we didn't disable it, we just have no trees. Okay, go grab that and that. Yeah, we need, we need a lot more. Oh yeah, we're building stuff here, aren't we? Yes, we need more stone. Yeah, we need more stone. Okay, let's go grab some stone. Where can we get it from? Well, uh, there's iron. I think that's iron. Yeah, that's iron. Um, got more babies. Got no more food. Uh, we're not doing too bad on food. Oh, we started harvesting. Excellent. Uh, I guess we could say to go collect that stone. Wow, well, we're going to have to go quite far now. Okay, let's just watch the food. We do have four cows, so when they build, build. When they have another one, we will um, uh, have to um, let one go and nom 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 them. Let's just watch the food. See, I'm hoping. I what I tried in the past, one of the previous episodes was, we were generating so much food, we had to build two barns and increase our food limit to like eleven thousand, and even that was not enough. We were generating so much food. So I turned off, like, I think these three farms temporarily, just to see if the six plus our little orchard here would handle the food demands. And it did fine for the first year, but after that, oh my god, everything just went downhill from there. It was ridiculous. I actually thought we were going to die of starvation at one point. I mean, the thing is with this game, now that we have a decent population, I don't think we can really lose. What can happen, of course, is... You know, we could have a huge fire that wipes out a good number of our population, or perhaps a disease, or even if we starve, we'd lose a load of people. But then, you know, like our food requirements, oops, would also, you know, kind of like just go down anyway. So we just turn off some farms, and that it, it, it's fine. Unless there's a tornado that really hung around and sucked all our dudes up, that's when we'd have a big problem. But I don't think we are going to have that really uh in fact we haven't had a tornado yet either so oh good and you have hit your uh cap we will go ahead and increase you to 800 see we, we have people dying of old age because we have a decent amount of laborers we a decent labor pool they're nicely replacing them you 10 i mean yeah we'll, we'll turn cutting off because we can tell you to cut that as and when uh, yeah, we don't need four builders, so how about we put two more in there? Have them all fully stocked, that should be fine and hunky-dory. Just gotta wait for that to regrow. Could cut these trees down. Now, so what are we gonna... What, what's the aim? I think we should aim to stabilize. How much leather do we have? Not a lot. Yeah, I think it's mostly in there. I think we need... Really, we need to add more... Fill. What would make me happy is adding more farms. 
what we want to do is eventually this is going to fill up and then we'll want to move over to here and I think we're saying have farms here and then move the, the this bunch of stuff up here to, um, when we do move over however that's not for a little while yet I don't think blacksmiths we're doing fine for that we do we did upgrade to better tools logs is low I know it's low it's always low everything's always low stop harassing me go go grab that and then you can also grab that uh, so yeah I don't know really it has been such a pain in ah here we go hopefully you'll be a uh, livestock trader and then we can go get some sheepy dudes uh, oh good 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 it's also late winter which means we can go start planting and oh we have finally all our paths done happy days uh, we also have a new laborer so that's back up to three we'll leave builders as two for the time being that's fine cheap new okay we'll just we'll just wait um yeah i don't know where to turn these off i mean food isn't doing too well we could turn this area into farms i mean why not because we, we got plans to move over here anyway i know i was going to keep this as like a residential area like bridged away from this but there's no reason not to and actually come to think of it like you know, if we had a disease in one of the, 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 the farms, this whole crop yield is going to go. I think if we did a few farms over here, maybe just one. I don't know if we'll be able to squeeze two in. Um, but yeah, definitely one. We'd at least have some food. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll add a nice big... What? Yeah, 15 by 15. I don't think we can have... Yeah, no. We'll do 15 by 15. There we go. Or, oh, balls. Well, let's do potatoes. There we go, that'll do. Um, we could, we could get rid of cherries, I guess. Well, not rid of them, but reduce it. I don't know. We'll leave it like it is. Should be fine. Now, obviously, they're not going to grow anything this year, because we literally just planted it in, well, might get a couple. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. But that does mean we will have to really consider moving over here quite soon because we have one more row of housing we can put in and then that's it. Like, you know, we could build more stuff here, but I kind of want to reserve this maybe for more schools, especially as our population grows. Um, you know, here's going to be a church and a cemetery, if I remember correctly. Uh, we may also want some more industry here. Uh, especially as this fills up, but I don't know. Let's we'll see how it goes. So, I mean, the, the, the trees are grown nicely. I think when the trees are grown, I'll tell them to chop everything down. Then we'll work on moving up here, turning this into another farm, and actually start migrating over there. Um, yeah, especially, yeah, we, we need to, because food... Uh, I don't know what's sustaining us. It might be a combination of the fish, the herbs, or the fish, the uh, the foraging, and the cattle ranches. As we are not doing great on food. Especially with our upgraded tools as well. Come on, plant faster, guys. Uh, especially with our upgraded tools. We're using, I think, steel tools. Yeah. And, yeah, we're, we're not doing too well at all. Wood's not doing too bad now, and we do have a decent amount of firewood stored up as well. As long as we maintain a supply of logs, that should be fine, I believe. Food's going up. <clears throat> Late summer. I mean, you're not doing too badly. You did get to like 70, I, sus I suppose. They auto-harvest as well when it becomes um, autumn. Or fall, I guess, uh, for some of you guys. There we go. So yeah, they'll, they'll start harvesting that now. But it does keep growing. Just because they're harvesting doesn't mean it stops. Um, yeah, it may not. It may just not get to 100. percent That's fine. We 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 never expect. Well, I never expected it to do that. Um, but saying that, then there is maybe we do actually upgrade this to stone roads as well. We put stone bridge. Oh, that'd be nice. There we go. Oh, boop. There we go. We may as well actually. Up upgrade this whole road to stone there. So we have tons of stone. 
Uh, and still got plenty left as well. That is fine. What's the stockpile we set? 60? Okay, that's cool. Do we have a trader coming? Nope. Okay. How much coal do we have? We have plenty of coal, but I guess... What should, what's the limit set at? 100? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Uh, it's a little bit concerning that, you know, there's still... Okay. That's fine. Don't go harvest them. That's annoying. Like, oh, there's there's a trader dude. Um, so yeah, they all these guys finished their farms, and I ah, we we could come help this really big farm, but we're not going to. Oh, oh my god, we could get chickens. Right, right. We put a chicken. Can we put a chicken coop up here? Uh, pasture. How big can you be? Ooh. That'd be a very nice farm, like a 10 by 10 farm. Hmm. Why could we squeeze in some chickens? 9 by 7? How many chickens would that be? I guess we could find out. Yeah, go 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 do that. Uh one, two. Oh yeah, we only need three. There we go. That'd be fine. Question is, do we want to splurge out on the chickens? Because all this should be enough. I think it's like, what, 1500 for, or 1200 for the sheep? Something like that. Um, I guess we could just start with two. That's 800. Um, I mean, we could do stone. That is so far to 10. How much leather do we have? That is a question. Not a lot. Well, okay, tell you what, we got plenty of stuff, so why not put, say, 30 steel tools in here? Now, how much? 10, okay. That's 300. Okay, never mind. We will buy a couple chickens. I think a couple chickens is fine. Uh, also, we'll increase you to two, so you can, like, hurry and get a star steel tools in here. Um, but yeah, I think uh, some chickens would be good. Just get eggs, uh, I guess, as well as chicken meat as well. So the the, the same idea of um, uh, maximum pasture size would work for here. I don't know if uh, this will be able to have like more than four because they're a lot smaller than these guys. We got them in here? Yes. Okay. Grab two. Thirty. Twenty. Okay, how about forty? Thirty. Here we go. Twenty-seven. Okay, can we wait? How long are you gonna take? All right. Okay. Well, fine. We'll see. Uh, we'll buy two chickens. That's what twenty-seven. And then I think it's all of these, and then all of these, wasn't it? Boom. Give me two chickens. There we go. Uh, chickens. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, that's more than uh, more than the cattle. Yeah, size definitely does count. Could you imagine? Could you imagine how many chickens we could have put here if we built a pasture that size? Oh, that would be absolutely ludicrous. Okay, this is going to bug me. Twelve. Could do twelve by twelve. Tell you what, we'll do 11 by 11. Nah, screw it, we'll do that. Why Why not? And we'll put beans there. We do need more people, though. Is that all full? No. We need three more people. Can we take people? Oh, okay, yeah, we don't need you, but I do want to keep a backlog of um, laborers as well. Miners, we could get rid of some miners, I suppose. There. Oh, yeah, that was close, because uh, everybody died, apparently. Uh, three. That's fine. Go tend the chickens. Little chicky doos. Oh, that's so cute. So yeah, we'll go up to 20 chickens here. That should be fine. 
I guess we get rid of some of these. Uh, although we don't have that much food left. There, 27. That's full farms. That should be fine. Uh, and then go ahead and build some paths here. There. Okay. See, I've noticed like beans go seem to grow really, really quick. But potatoes, they seem to grow like in mid-summer to late summer. Or well, in summer, rather. I guess these are spring crops and then these are... Uh, I suppose, I guess if we change some of these to potatoes, it wouldn't be too bad. It might be, because I suppose you build, uh, have a load of beans. I'm sorry, what? Why are we only getting so little yields? Like, there's also like a whole strip here that isn't farming. Why, what? Why is this happening, guys? Okay, this is actually quite worrying. I mean, we'll, we'll keep an eye on it, but I'm pretty sure there should be more higher than that. This is, uh, it's reason like this, I thought, oh, maybe crop rotation is a thing, but we have never planted stuff up here. Maybe it's just a bad season. I don't know if there's, like, some randomness to it. Maybe we're just getting lucky last time. Yeah, it's early summer. Oh, come on. Uh, you know what I forgot to do as well? I forgot to order uh, sheep from them next. Dang it. Oh, whatever. Okay. So, oh, there we go. Now the potatoes are rising pretty quick. Hopefully it's going to be enough to uh, uh, account for the food because we have no food again. Are they grown? Yeah, so not not 100%. We'll maybe leave it another season. Um, we're in no re- well... We're not in really a rush to uh to grow too much. Wow, these are taking a while to grow as well. Oh uh, yeah, we're not in a rush to actually expand here specifically. It's more the farms I want. Uh, you. Yeah. How are we doing? Late summer. Did you actually get to 100? No, you got to like 80 for some reason. It must have just been a bad harvest. Bad year, perhaps. I don't know. It's, it's literally just capped off. And I used to think this is because, you know, like I said, crop rotation was a thing. But like I said, we have never planted stuff here, and even these have capped off at 80. So it must just be like a RNG type thing. I don't know. How's the chickens doing? Ah, oh, we're up to three. There's a little chicky do. Oh, okay. So it is the harvest time. Last time I think we got to about 3,000, and we've had a few births, of course, but we've also had quite a lot of deaths. Uh, overall, our population, I don't think, has really changed all that much. So we should hopefully... I would aim for about 4,000, 4,500 would be nice. But we do have to bear in mind that this is apparently a really bad season, uh, and that we didn't actually grow up to 100% yield for some reason. Let's just hope that these guys will actually collect all of the harvest this time and not leave this chunk here or any of these chunks oh please don't do that oh it's, it's only uh it's, it's mid autumn it's a cold mid autumn though oh no yeah they're dying out oh i mean we did get to our our, our goal though so that's fine and logs are doing fantastic actually I could really do sheep though 30 leather. Uh, we're getting a bit of leather again. What stuff do we have? Uh, yeah, can we, like... Where's the steel tools? Uh, okay, yeah, steel tools can stay here. Uh, I, I forgot that that's a number they want to maintain. But that's fine. We had tons of iron and we had tons of coal to account for that increase. So that's, that's probably fine. 4,000 food. Hopefully that will keep us going. How is the forest doing? They're pretty much grown. I mean, can maybe turn you off cutting? Ooh. Oh, please be sheep. Firewood. Darn it. We need to start getting uh, beer. That's a very important commodity. Super duper important. Oh, see, everyone's dying as well. Because of old age. See, our adult population just dropped like by five. That's crazy. Um, 
I suppose if we're only planting now, uh, it may not be a bad idea just to reduce this a little bit more. Okay, we'll do that. That one too. Yeah. There. So that should make you at what, three? Yes, okay, that's fine. Um, just because, uh, you know, we're gonna deforest this whole area event uh, manually. <sighs> kind of think of what we do here. Also, when we do do this, uh, do do, uh, I'm going to go ahead and remove this road and repave it along here because that has been bugging me for a long time. I'm kind of thinking though that we could, we plan the farms out. So may we go ahead and no, go ahead and deforest. Wait, I did click that right. Yeah, deforest all of this. There, so they can go ahead and get rid of that. We can plan out our farms. Uh, that should be fine. Okay, yeah, it must have just been a bad season because they're growing along here now. That's odd. It must be just randomly generated, determined or something, I guess. Um, how, what do we need for this? Right, okay. Is it the difference? It might just, yeah. So that's just how much it costs to build. 15, 24, that's what, 8 extra. Yeah, we need more logs. But, but, uh, I guess you can plant as well now uh, however we are going to chop all this forest down and eventually this as well so we're going to have plenty and what we'll do is upgrade these to uh, stone houses that should be hunky dory uh, we also have all this forest here if we ever need to, uh, to to cut stuff down however I'll turn you on cutting as well just while we wait how are chickens doing? six? nice so, yeah you're doing a lot better this time like late spring you're up to like 60% I know it's low. It's fine. We're at 50%. It's not even summer yet. Yeah, this is doing much better. It must have just been a bad harvest, a uh, bad uh, growing season. Uh, wait, what? No bads. Well, I'm going to say a big fat no. What else do we have? Let's look at graphs. I like graphs. Textiles? Oh, I don't care about that. Population. I know it's total population. Just keeps going up. Yeah. So we have kind of capped off here for adult population. Uh, that's 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 actually ideal. The you know people are dying, but they're being replaced. Hmm. No one's got any clothes. <laughs> that's hilarious. Uh, we really need sheep. I mean, we could set it to build with, um, create clothing with leather, but I don't think we have enough cattle to maintain that. Like, oh, scarlet fever. Oh no. See, I don't get this. Like, we have ton. We have like a hospital. Why are we getting like really bad health? Because we need more of these. How much medicine? Do oh, we have no medicine. Yeah, that might do it. Okay, now uh, let's go ahead and speed up time again. So yeah, this may be where we lose a load of people to death, and like, but it is at the uh, harvest stage. So even if that happens, it's not going to be the end of the world. How many people we got sick? Does it say? Yeah, three people. That's not too bad. Uh, so yeah, we're going to get some more cows in a sec. We actually got milk from them. I don't know if there's like, actual like dairy farms. Wow. We lost another four people. <gasps> Those people are dying. Of okay, this is actually bad. So we're losing people to old age. And we're losing people to... Okay. No one's okay, Scarlet Fever's gone. Never mind. False alarm. Ignore me. What's this? Up to eight? Nice. Are we good? Can you... Okay, so these still aren't doing too great. Uh, they are going up to... Like, this one did well. Oh! Oh, please be sheep. Time oh. I have to tell you, I don't want your firewood. We have plenty of firewood. How much did we get up to? I don't know. Didn't see. That's fine, though. Um... Yeah, they should start chopping these down as well, because when you're not in a growing season, the farmers, uh, I think, become laborers, and they'll, so they should go and chop these trees down for us. Ooh, we could really do is replacing some adults. How much, how's food doing? Up to 4,000 already? Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. Okay. So this is maintaining us, but if we want to grow, I'd feel a lot more comfortable when we get this... Uh, up here 
uh, this farm over there done. Um, yeah, I think we have more or less stabilized now. I don't think we're in danger of starving out. Uh, guys, could you really please? Oh my god, why do we keep missing food? So annoying. Seriously, just go go collect it. Like other farmers from other fields, go collect the food! Whatever. Well, I think we are in a safe place. We have a bunch of chickens, so when that hits 10... I don't know, uh, we must be getting eggs. Yeah, so we're getting eggs, which is good. Um, and now that we're about to hit 10, and they breed pretty quick to be fair, but when when we hit 10, they should uh, start, we should get, be getting a bit more meat, um, which is good. And we're still aiming to get some sheep as well, so we can put in this pen and get some wool, and then we can actually create some clothing for our people. Uh, that would be most ideal. But I think in the next episode, what we're gonna do, wait, what? Dysentery, oh my God. Why is it... If you guys got any tips on how we can increase the health... Like, we have a hospital. Do we need, like, other stuff? I mean, we handled it pretty easy. There's, like, no issues involved. Can you not go to your house? Can you go to the hospital? Thank you. Um, yeah, so, I don't know. I, I thought a hospital would make us be fine for health, but maybe I'll look into some other buildings uh, in the next episode, but... Primarily, we're going to be focused on turning this into farms because that's what we need most of all. And of course, we will be moving all this up here. Uh, event. Well, should we do it next time? Hmm. I mean, we could build the houses here and then say screw it and then start moving over. Like, literally build out this area fully before we move. I don't know. I give it some thought. And we'll see what we do next time. But I, I guess it doesn't hurt either way to start planning this area. So that's what we'll probably end up doing. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed it, please leave a like on the video. And if you uh, feel like it, please let me know in the comments down below how you feel this episode's going. Uh, especially if you've got any tips on how we can improve the health. Because I thought having a hospital would be fine. But apparently not. They're still getting sick and we still have really crappy health. But they're super happy. So... But yeah, we, we've set, we've say, we've come back from the brink with our food issues. Like it's uh, early spring, we have like 2,000 food left over, so I'm perfectly happy with those levels. Uh, and you know, th these two farms have really, really helped us, I think. But that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel, and don't forget to hit the bell button just so you can uh, get notified as and when we have more episodes going live. But I will see you guys in the next episode. Till then, take care.